hey guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to be talking about these nails here yes yeah, so i basically gonna give y'all the rundown i'm basically gonna give y'all the rundown on my nails let y'all guys know what i use and why i use it and all that good stuff but i just want to do a disclaimer like i my genetics are like i just have growing nails growing toenails growing hair etc so it's in my dna if you're a type of person that nails are very brittle and they don't grow as long as this then i'm not sure if this is going to work for you but maybe you should try it and you know maybe it will work for you but i've been growing my nails out for about three months now sometimes when they break i cut them so they all could be the same length but um, I'm gonna just show you my routine. I have a bowl here. I have put, put uh, I put baking soda, regular baking soda, and I put I squeeze a lemon inside. Lemon um, cleans your nails, and yeah, it's good for strengthening your nails, etc. So I just basically, you know, soak them in here. I soak them in for a little bit. I use like lukewarm water, but sometimes I waited too long, so now it's cold. <laughs> So I just soak it. I just want to get my nail beds like nice and moist. Not moist. Um, what you call that? Nice and moisturized. I want to say moisturized, but like get them moist so I could just pull off the dead skin. It's been a while since I did uh nail care, like since I've gave myself a manicure. So yeah. See, I just get it nice and wet. I get my nail beds nice and moist dripping came through dripping all right first i take this little um i would say spatula <laughs> this little tool here it has this on one end and it has this on the other i use this side here you can get this from any beauty supply store and i just basically hope you guys can see i just basically um push this down to get all the dead skin off <laughs> And I want to take this tool. Please be careful with this tool. This tool is good for peeling off the dead skin. These little tweezer things. So I just basically, whatever's here at the cuticle, I just pull it. did that we're gonna go to this buffer this buffer but believe it or not i got this from dollar tree for a dollar and it has literally like literally it has four steps this is step one where you just shape your nails so i'm gonna just shape them to the box shape that i have them already i'm just gonna uh, we're gonna do step one now step two is the smooth this is going to be step two. Okay, now we're going to go to step three. Which is buff. Now we're gonna notice the four, which this side I like because it really shines your nails. Okay, you see how crusty it'll look right here? Watch till after I use this buffer. Look how shiny they just got. Like you just see, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like super shiny. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this organic coconut oil I got from Walmart um, I guess you can go to Walmart or I don't know who else sells this but I'm gonna use my coconut oil and I'm gonna just take a dab on my hands and just put it on my nail beds I usually use um, what you call that I usually use cuticle oil but um, I feel that coconut oil is more natural 
And this is how I get my nails to look all moisturized and healthy. Not too much. So I'm going to do the other hand. This is my favorite hand because this hand is longer as you can see. This hand is longer. So I'm going to just do this hand, the same thing I just did and yeah. So yeah, my hands look a little, look a little greasy, but it's all good. It's all about the moisture. And I also have been taking hair skin vitamins, these gummies right here. These have been popping. These have really been helping my nails grow faster, if anything. Um, as far as the hair, yeah. To me, my hair is growing, but it's growing faster in other places meaning my legs etc so I advise you if you're a very hairy person or a semi hairy person like me I suggest that you like take it at least three times a week not every day like I was doing in the first in the beginning because this is my second bottle but yeah this is pretty good this has been helping me out a lot a lot a lot and I also drink a lot of water and I also take other vitamins such as the one a day one one a day woman as well this has hair and hair vitamins and skin vitamins as well so i suggest you try supplement if it's not working fast enough for you i wanted my nose to hurry up and grow so yeah so now i'm gonna go in with this polish right here this is the sally hansen hardener polish i use this polish to keep my nails strong i can't even get this open because i got all this coconut oil on me so I just basically use this to keep my nails like hardened so they won't bend easily. Okay, this is my nail care routine. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like. And don't forget to share this video. And if you want to see more nail care videos and maybe you want to see my nail collection, my nail polish collection, let us sister know. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to watch my latest videos. I will have it in the link in the bottom bar i love you guys so much i think i said that already but i'm gonna let y'all know again that i love you guys so much and see y'all guys in the next video laters